Hello everyone, welcome to Mango Men Homestead. So I want to give you a little bit of what we're doing here in August. It's I think the 6th of August and we've finished our harvest and now we need to go in. We need to make new plans. We need to do our pruning. We need to do our planting. All right, so just want to give you just kind of a quick idea of what we're doing. So first of all, in our planting, we're always trying to control height, keep our trees small, productive, efficient, and it's the only way because we have a very limited amount of space with a lot of different trees. So here you go. This is a sweet tart tree with an orange sherbet tree, um, and they're both grafted on um, piva rootstock, which will help keep them small, but they still need help in keeping them pruned. Okay, so now I just took off those, uh, oh, and let me just back up for a second and say, in order to do your pruning in our orchard, you really only need loppers like this, hand clippers like this, a saw, and then this is also a telescoping clippers that I use in our orchard. But now that I've cut off this branch, I'm going to take these branches right over to here. So one of the things is in our orchard, we have, we're very much a, uh, uh, this is a, a, a property full of large solution holes. So we have very little soil. So we have to build our own soil. So now we don't take off anything. We cut up everything on property. So after cutting this off, I'm now using the loppers to cut them up. Like that. We don't have a chipper. We have loppers. Alright. So there. Now cut that up and this will, will um, rot down. And this makes our soil. You can see here, we're already planting new trees. Um, this is a, a newly grafted tree that we're planting in here. Um, it's actually a manolita. And again, grafted on a piva rootstock so that we can maintain the size and keep them productive and keep our efficiency. Because we have very, very limited space and we have to do this in order to to we, we keep we keep building the soil never carry anything away keep mulching 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 it's what allows our trees to be healthy planting new trees always making decisions taking out things that don't do uh, that don't produce well for us that produce too that have too much disease or what what have you but we have to constantly do it one other thing i would like to show here is if you look right above us these are pigeon plums right here and the reason you see these in our orchard is we still believe in um, maintaining our trees um, we have to maintain our trees with uh, cold protection because when you have a young tree like this um, it's very susceptible to cold damage early in the year we, I know we're in uh, global climate change and all of that, but one of these days we're going to get a freeze, and so we have to do this. So thank you very much, and uh, we'll be back to talk with you again later.